Oh, a pleasant good Wednesday morning. It's the 11th of August. It's humid out. It's going to be in the mid to upper 80s with high humidity. Almost like Tokyo during the Olympics. It's even worse in Philly where it's going to be in the mid 90s with 65% humidity. It's miserable out there on the East Coast. Yeah, they had a rain delay last night. Uh, Philly gets real seasons though. Not like we do. But yes, it's going to be humid here too. And the Angels, of course, are still playing the Blue Jays down in Anaheim, where it's going to be warm and humid as well. Yeah, it's the battle of MVPs, Shohei Otani against Vlad Guerrero Jr. And uh, yeah, the Blue Jays are happy to be back in Toronto after playing in Buffalo, New York and Florida because of COVID restrictions. And now it's back to uh, Toronto. And uh, yes, the Angels still trail the Astros by 10 and a half, but they're right at 500. The Dodgers are only four games behind the Giants, but the Dodgers better hurry up and catch fire. They're 68 and 45, while their arch enemy rivals are 72 and 41. So like I told you, every game is a must win for the Dodgers. And I hope that the Giants go cold eventually and have a losing streak. But the Dodgers have to take care of business against the Phillies and the Mets on this East Coast road trip, while the Giants are at home taking on terrible teams like the Diamondbacks and the Rockies. The Padres are playing a bad Marlins team right now. Yeah, they have one more. Uh, the Angels are playing an average Blue Jays team, but then they host the Houston Astros this weekend coming up. And, and the Astros only lead the A's by two games. Yeah, the A's have another game against the Guardians and the Reds play the Braves that are in the wild card chase. The Pirates are playing the Cardinals and the Yankees are playing the Royals. But yeah. I, I only see the Brewers making it to the playoffs in the, in the Central. Same with the Eastern Division. Either the Phillies or the Mets are going to win that division. Uh, Dodgers, Giants, of course, that's one of the best rivalries at the moment. And the Padres are in the wild card race too, but the Angels will barely finish out or below 500 this year. They just don't have it because of the injuries to Mike Trout and Anthony Rendon and they don't have the pitching. The Dodgers have the pitching, but our, our pitching staff has been shorthanded all year too, you know, with Kershaw still on the DL. Um, Dustin May's out for the year. Um, that's why we gotta rely on Bueller and Urias. That's why we signed uh, Max Scherzer and Cole Hamels. Yeah, this has been an injury rate pl plague season, and many of our starting position players missing s some significant time too. And the Padres are without Fernando Tatis for a while. Yeah, they're, they're they still find ways to win though. Uh, the A's, of course, are trying to keep pace with Houston. Um, but anything can happen during the final 49 games of the season. And that's it. Uh, meanwhile, have a great day and I'll talk to you later. Let's go Dodgers, let's go Angels, and let's go uh, Rockies and let's go Diamondbacks. And all right, amen.